At 748, it is the home stretch for the UH men's basketball team. The team looks to make a push for the Big West. Coach Aran Ganat is here. Good morning, Coach. How are you? Great. Thanks for having me. I know you just got off the plane just a little while ago. Okay, so last two games at home. How incredible is this? It's awesome. I think it's the first time since I've been here we finished the conference late at home. So it's college basketball, it's March Madness, Simplify Arena at the Stan Sheriff Center, Senior Week. I know yes. Senior Night gets a lot of pub on Saturday, um, but it's really Senior Week. Two big games, a lot at stake. Yeah, you got six seniors uh, responsible. I think your top five scorers are also in this class. How special have these seniors been? Incredible. We've had a lot of great senior groups. I don't know if we've had as large as a senior group. You know, I'm starting with Javon McClanahan, yeah. Bernardo De Silva, and Noel Coleman. Three guys who've been here at least four years. That's not normal in college basketball. It's refreshing. Three guys who are among the leaderboards in the history of the program in points and rebounds and assists. Then you've got Juan Munoz in his eighth year. Yeah. Has come back from Dealt four season-ending surgeries. Guy, Maybe one yeah. of the great stories in college basketball. And then grad transfers and Justin McCoy, who's playing at all conference level. Matt Cotton, who's giving us a lift. Yeah, McCoy, by the way, transfer from North Carolina of all schools. I mean, that's incredible. Uh, okay, so what, what is the celebration going to be like? Uh, I know you got a couple of things that are special, right? Yeah, well, first, look, these, there's a lot at stake. As you know, yeah. at the end of the year, you're always trying to find fight for momentum going into the conference term, which is the following week. But right now, with the way seedings work, people are fighting for top two. You get a yeah. double buy. Top four, you get a buy. Top eight, get in. So people are fighting to get in. Wednesday is a, game, a, great, a really big game against CSUN, who's right there with us in yeah. the league standings. It's going to be uh, another one of those special jerseys being auctioned off. Island Heritage, I think you've seen them. I think there's a graphic for them. A lot of buzz about those jerseys, really cool, um, really sweet. Yeah, okay, so, so it, was, it was kind of a tough start to the season, right? Yep. I mean, how did you guys turn things around? You won seven of the last ten. You know, where do things start to go right? Well, you talked about we've always had a great group, great leadership. We've never fragmented. We've never been divisive. We stayed with it. And obviously, guys have stepped up as well. We talked about our six seniors setting the tone. Our fans have stuck with us, which has really helped us build us some momentum. And guys have stepped up, whether it's off the bench. We've done that when we've had, you know, a guy like Morissette out for the year. Javon McClanick hand missed five games. But this group's building momentum. They're getting better. They're focused on the task at hand. Hopefully, we continue to do yeah, that. Yeah, and okay, and I, this is probably a loaded question, Coach, and I know you're probably like, what? Okay. Bring but, it up. But, but to, have, to have that kind of senior leadership in this day and age with the, the NIL, with the, with, with the transfer portal, you know, how nice is it to have this group of guys that, that has just been able to stabilize everything and, and make things a little well, easier? Well, the landscape you? of college athletics has changed significantly. Continuity is still an important number. It's just a different number. Yeah. You know, it might be a little less where some people are complete overhauls. We're not going to have that. I think it's more of a credit to the kids, uh, their families, uh, the University of Hawaii, our athletic administration, coaching uh, the staff. state. Yeah, we just on. try not to screw it up. But <laughs> these kids feel like they're at home here. Our fans have been incredible to them. It's a special place, and so I think it's all encompassing. The, the, how special Hawaii is is why these guys have stayed here. Yeah, you, you might not want to say it, but you're a big part of that too. I so okay, it. so it's it's not senior night, it's senior week. Uh, the games are Saturday. What is the other one? Is it Thursday? Is so Wednesday, Thursday? it's a Wednesday, unique, it's, it's a quick okay, turnaround. Usually yeah. we come back, it's Thursday, Saturday. This week it'll be Wednesday, Saturday, senior week. Incredible jerseys. You'll yeah. get more information. Visit HawaiiAthletics.com because these Island Heritage uniforms, They're it's cool. like when we brought back the retro uniforms. My phone's been buzzing about it, and I wish I had more control about <laughs> how we can get these out. But, um, again, it goes quick. This is an opportunity for us to celebrate this great group and these great seniors, but it's an opportunity for our seniors and all of us to thank our awesome fans. Yeah, and I know you'll reload next year, but at the same time, we do want to say bye. Thank you, yes. Coach. Appreciate thank it. Thank you. Appreciate uh, it. Over to you, Guy.